Uh, first of all, we need to be clear that there are many uh, schools of design, schools of thought, different workflows. But from my point of view, and many others as well, uh, I would say that sketching and modeling is, uh, are two of the most uh, prominent um, ways of thinking for in, in the conceptual stage of design. As architects, I believe we can adapt easily to technology. Uh, we started with sketches and pens, physical models. We can easily switch to other techniques such as uh, smart boards, uh, caves, virtual reality, laser cutting technology. Uh, we can easily shift, we can easily use technology with different forms. Computer modeling has always been the most favorite tool for us, but uh, as uh, compared to physical model, you can't really uh, touch it, hold it, manipulate it, you can't really feel the scale. This is a major drawback in uh, computer models. After trying the project, uh, the Immersa model, I believe it's, I believe this is what I really dreamed of. It's the ultimate solution for what we've been looking for. You can scale, you can move, you can translate, you can rotate, you can start something from scratch, you can modify your original design, you can see it, you can touch it, you can look around it. I believe it's a great project, it's a good start. Uh, it still has many frontiers to cover. We can work on different things, different uh, disciplines, architects, interior designers, urban planners, urban designers, product designers, anything that has to do with the human scale, with the touch, with the perception, it would be a very great tool.